hits right below the knee. That's a terrible place. Got the bag here. Let's open this bad boy up. They're a pair of men's cargo shorts. These are just like your regular dad shorts. I have no idea on what I'm going to do. <laughs> They're not here to be cute. They're here to be functional. Oh, okay, okay. Just gonna unfurl it a little. There is a way to do the khaki cargo thing fashionably. I would not say that this is that. It's not something that was really included in the plus size clothing world. Wow, I can officially be a, a dad. I have never, ever sold cargo shorts. Party on the top, snacks for everyone on the bottom. I have never worn a pair of cargo shorts in my entire existence. I feel like cargo shorts are the original sin of fashion and I'm excited to style them. Here are the shorts on my actual body. Surprisingly, they don't fit as tragically as I was expecting them to. I think I was expecting suburban white boy, camp counselor vibes. My initial thought is this solid white bodysuit, but I have this other bodysuit that is like a striped situation. I don't really wear khaki, so we have no idea how this is gonna come out. It's a fail, it doesn't work. Scratch everything that I was thinking. I look a hot mess. This is a tragedy. This looks like a mistake, like not an intentional outfit. Okay, y'all, so I am going to try this like linen tank top, very simple, but I'm gonna try to make it like an off the shoulder situation. It doesn't really have a shape, so I'm going to try to give it a shape and we'll see how this works. I'm starting to love this already. Now I put on these little vans. I'm gonna see if I can find like a cute graphic situation. Oh wait. This, this could be fun. To me, it's giving me skater girl vibes, which I love, like skater girl style culture. I think it's super cute. I feel like the third look was more my style. So we'll see how I accessorize it. These are what the shorts look like. I look like um, one of those like safari hunters or the crocodile hunter. Lately, I've been really loving using dresses as tops, and I think this would be interesting to style with the cargo shorts. I think it would look better if this dress wasn't like peeking out here. We'll keep looking. <laughs> I love this off-shoulder top. I think it makes it a little more edgy, I guess. Yeah, I feel like it's getting closer. I really love this top with the black belt. I'm not saying that I like it, but I'm not saying that I hate it. If you come this way, you can see my rack of clothing. Now, I have to see what will go with the cargo shorts. The thing with cargo shorts is, one, I never wear them. I've only ever worn cargo pants. This is what they look like on bod. I think I'm gonna probably either cut these, or if not, I'll probably just fold them because I'm too lazy to cut these. This is the pants on. Definitely longer than I thought it would be. Definitely reminds me of my gym teacher. Kinda like it with this top. I picked a brown belt because I only own two belts. I know. And I kinda like it with this top. I'm not gonna lie, the top that I'm originally wearing for this, it's soups cute. Uh, 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 let's go. I just kinda put this cute. Greenish, one piece. Honestly, I'm really liking this as my contender. Guys, am I like cute or something? Let's go on a Sephora adventure. I really like this. This is like my born and bred New York. I wish I had a pair of Tim's. This is my favorite, I'm not gonna lie. All right, they are on <laughs> and they are something. It weirdly fits me perfectly and I can pull them up high-waisted which means I maybe can do a cute belt moment, a little crop top moment. I could go total safari explorer and I'm not mad at it. This is kind of cute. There's also something cute about having this like more femme lacy top with these like harder cargo shorts. I don't know what to wear. Okay, I think I found my outfit. I'm a little worried you guys are gonna think it's too basic, but it feels the most me and it makes me happy. I think it's actually really cute. So what they look like on. I feel like I can do anything in these. For my first look, I went with 90s skater look. Let's go shred, guys. <laughs> 
I love this. Look number two, which is just like a casual dad look. This is like dad taking his kid to the park. Dad vibe. They're what I expected, so hideous. I think I want the whole look to be pretty neutral because I did this loud blue eye. So I'm thinking like femish skater girl. A tiny top might be cute. I could also go sort of like stereotypical lean into the skater vibe. Is that makeup all over that? I don't know. That could be a thing maybe. I think that these four shirts are all good options, but I'm pulled to my tiny top. So let's see how that looks. I was a skater girl. I said see you later girl. Y'all get into this fit right now for me please. Kind of I'm so pleased. Okay, girl. However, got some room, which means I'm gonna have to take it in in the back. Huh, my phone's down. With the help of some safety pins, I was able to get this to fit my waist. So this is the first look. I feel very Kim Possible. This is the second option. I mean, I don't hate this. I do think it might be a little bit too brown. I don't know. Next, we have this top. I'm obsessed with how these are kind of like the same colors as this. I love how the top is obviously more sexy than the short. It's a good juxtaposition. This is like safari chic, and I actually really love how this looks. I now understand why men wear cargo shorts. These are the most comfortable thing in the entire freaking world. I pulled three potential tops. I also pulled this beautiful shirt that I forgot I had. This combo is really pretty like color wise. So I'm gonna also give this one a try. This top is like super oversized. So I'm trying to figure out a way to like tie it so I don't have to tuck it in. So I feel like it's really bulky if I do that. This is a different vibe. I, this is like giving me like Nigel Thornberry vibes. I don't hate this either. I pulled this bag and this bag because the straps kind of match. Also decided to cut them. So I'm gonna actually cut them right where this is. So it's still a little bit shorter. So they made it more of like a raw hem. Finally figured out what my look's gonna be and I'm so excited for you guys to see. If I was in a Midwest butch before, I thought about really just like leaning into like the <laughs> lesbian cargo shorts look. It's hard. These shorts are just like, not the cutest, y'all. <laughs> I tried to put a suit jacket with it, seeing if I could, no, no. Okay, this isn't what I'm gonna wear, but like honorable mention, I'm inspiring myself. So I think we're on the right path. I'm kind of digging this look. I kind of really like it. I put on some earrings. I need to find shoes, but I think this might be, this might be a vibe for me. Ultimately, I decided to style my cargo shorts with a gray, dusty tank top. I accessorized it with some jumbo gold hoops, a very dainty gold necklace, and also some bangles that I bought in South Africa. And I wore some classic van sneakers. And then around the waist, I tied my dad's army fatigue jacket. Overall, I really like this look. I just really love the crisscross backing of this shirt and then the poofy sleeves. And then I also paired it with black boots. I really like the jewelry that I chose. I just layered this gold chain, this star necklace, and this moon necklace. And then of course my earrings. I also topped it off with my bucket hat. For my look, I chose a tiny black top, some chains, vans and a cropped denim jacket and i'm really feeling this look for my look i paired it with my beautiful white durango cowboy boots and my amazing lime green purse finally i added my wannabe guchi sunglasses and i thought the look came out pretty great for this look i put on my multicolored pumas and my brown belt with it then we have my fenty bralette and then next we have my earrings and gold necklace I'm calling it Safari Chic. I paired it with some heels. I added some gold jewelry, some sunglasses, and I'm ready for the safari party, baby. I would describe this as going to the zoo on a Saturday vibe. I got the cute bucket hat and the jewelry, and I got the leopard backpack to match my leopard hat. I got some combat boots, and I put these little lace socks to make it a little bit more feminine. Ready to go to the zoo. 
I decided to pick the more mauve button down top. I added some gold accessories. I chose these sandals to go with the whole entire look to balance the feminine on top and I am very happy with the way my outfit turned out. I went with this really cool halter top that's nice and satanic and then I've got my pyramid belt. I got my flame little platform shoes. I got this really awesome suede hat. Now I'm ready to ski all over town. What I ended up doing was wearing the khaki cargo shorts with this men's button up and then I put on some hoop earrings. I put on some big Nike shoes that I had and some sunglasses and I really loved it. Oh, <laughs> 